developing this morning. A man accused of hiding an explosive device inside his bag and bringing it to an airport will face a judge this morning. A TSA officer discovered the device at Lehigh Valley International Airport. Waukesha Bailey has more on how this suspect was caught. Well, a virtual detention hearing is scheduled today for the suspect. Now, passengers were in awe that a man tried to get through security with explosives. Here's 40-year-old Mark Muffley, caught Monday night on security cameras leaving the Lehigh Valley International Airport after TSA agents paged him over the intercom to report to security. Muffley is charged with possessing an explosive in an airport and possessing or attempting to place an explosive device on an aircraft. Officials say the material was found in Muffley's suitcase that he checked in headed to Orlando. Inside the lining of his luggage, officials discovered a circular compound around three inches in diameter wrapped in a wax-like paper and clear plastic wrap. It was hidden. It was, you know, the fuse was secreted in the lining of the suitcase. So it's an indicator that Mr. Muffley um, allegedly knew that he wasn't supposed to be bringing that on an airplane. Authorities also recovered other items, including a can of butane and a lighter. The FBI arrested Muffley late Monday night at a home in Carbon County. I'm glad he was stopped. I mean, it's, it's never fun to travel. It's always uh, a little bit of nerve wracking. So I'm glad that they found that person and uh, glad it was stopped. Oh, just everything that the TSA does. I mean, makes us all feel safer in the skies. Oh, we were alarmed because this is just such a small airport, and we're usually, you know, my mother lives right down the street, so we love coming here because it's just so close by and small and convenient. So for it to happen here, we were a little bit shocked that somebody tried to pull something at a small airport. Our little neighborhood airport is what we think of it. Court records show that Muffley has been arrested several times in the past, mostly for retail theft. Again, now he's facing very serious federal charges as he awaits a virtual detention hearing scheduled for later today. Back to you. All right. Thank you very much, Waukesha. Now